Hello everyone, what is cooking all you good looking people out there and welcome to another exciting episode of GeoGuessr. Let's explore the world, you and I, together. And this time, in full screen. Although last time I'm not sure if I was or wasn't, but I have a feeling that I wasn't. Where is this beautiful place? My goodness, it's really wonderful. Well, we always start off the episode by just taking a random stab as to where we are in the world. And um, based on this cactus right over here, I can say without a doubt that we could be nowhere else but Mexico. And where do we have beautiful mountains? Well, if you go sort of here, uh, right, right into here, I'm going to say we are definitely in this place right there and no we were south africa obviously that cactus didn't grow there uh without a doubt was said very sarcastically by the way he had no idea where we were 94 points in total 14,680. that cactus is something that i do associate with mexico though so that's too bad south africa was the answer okie dokie well today's just a regular challenge so what we're going to do is we are going to create one ourselves make three minutes on the timeline right here and going to have a url you guys can go down in the description below click on that link go do it yourself come back to the video watch me do it and then at the end you can comment on how i did how you did how we did how we all did or any fun things that pop up during oh i don't, don't really like that i showed that for not very long i'm gonna have to look at that myself but whatever the hell the url was you guys can see it down below it was it's in the video clearly at some point so there you go, time limited challenge accepted. Very good. Oh yeah. Okie dokie. So where are we now? Hmm. This is which direction should we go in? Go in this one? Well, I mean I can see that we're probably in Australia, to be honest. Because the uh, the signs right here are on this side of the road. And then, uh, the, I mean the cars are driving on that side of the road as well. So that's, I mean, that's a pretty big indication right there. I mean, what else do we have to go about? Pronto, it doesn't really tell me much. Uh, big, big trees, big awesome trees. Very, very wet weather. This seems like, uh, with, with, and with this being said, with having no knowledge of how the place actually looks, this Mundara Community Center, this looks like the kind of place that hides around Melbourne, right? Oh, definitely, to me, it does. The thing about uh, Australia is that I seriously. Business Coast, maybe. Number one action coach. Okay. Do we see a website anywhere? Uh, I don't know. Bank Bank West. Well, uh, Bank West to me says Western Australia. So that's where we're going to go with instead. And uh, where is uh, where is beautiful? Oh, my God, Mundara. Oh, my God, I might actually get good here. Okay, let's... Uh, well, don't we don't really need to return to start location. I think it's actually fairly clear. We were actually on this this section right here and um if i yeah i mean it's we we were just on that street right that's 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 it we know where we are let's return to start location and make sure so let's go see the roundabout oh look at that it's the beautiful roundabout this roundabout right over here wow we're gonna get like six thousand points that's really good okay well let's actually return to start location and try and get like an exact bead so we are on the coast close to the roundabout so we are literally like right there uh let's zoom in a little bit more and say right there great okay so that's going to be a perfect score why don't we just check this place out a little bit more uh because you know it's three limit i mean it's, it's it is a beautiful place my god i can't believe we found it too that's really impressive i'm very happy to see that i mean just look at this that is i mean what a what a wonderful place that was i'm really happy that i was able to see oh, there's a guy kayaking right in there God, if I did that on a day like this, I would get so burnt up. Let's make that guess, and uh, we... Oh, I can't believe it. One point away. Oh, I guess two... Oh, I missed out by one single point. Oh, not a perfect score. Oh, well. Boo-hoo, that's fine with me. All right. Next one. Well, this could really help. Um, yeah, the this definitely means that we are in Poland, right? Polski Zwiazek... Uh, Emeritov, uh, don't know it. Any, okay, I'm gonna, stop, I'm gonna stop trying to read that, but I guess that means we're in Poland, uh, which is, which is helpful because if that wasn't really the case, then what would I do? O quadri quasi sutteri. Mm, well, mm, beautiful Poland. Well, I guess we got lucky with that. Now, where in Poland? Poland's a big place. Poland. We are in a place. Uh, it, does that does that Z word really mean anything to us? Well, it means something to someone, but does it actually mean the name of a place? Maybe it does, maybe it doesn't. 
I don't really see anything on the map that uh, sort of jumps out at my face. It really gets the really gets that sort of big in your face sort of thing that I want here. So we're gonna go with I mean uh, Gdynia. What uh, sort of around here maybe? Yeah, okay, that sounds about good to me. Why don't we take a look at what we can see around us? See if we can find some nice places. Oh, okay, we got a little sign here. That's always useful, isn't it? Let's go take a look at it. Ooh, biblioteca, library, or is that a bookstore? It could be one of the, it could be one of the two, or maybe both. I'm not really sure. It could mean a few things, or it could mean neither, which would be a real, really strange one if it means neither of them. Mm -hmm. Oh boy. So what have we got here? We've got um, I can't. Z okay, Z Z V G Oh boy, I'm gonna try reading that, but I'm gonna. Well, I guess I am gonna try reading it, but it didn't really. That didn't really work. Uh, um, is there any chance that this and this are the same thing? No, there isn't. They sort of end similar, Choa, but that doesn't really help. Choa could be a common suffix for a name here. Honestly, it's probably what I'm going to choose anyways, because since I'm going to say, oh, well, since there's a common suffix, they should be right beside each other, right? Absolutely not, but seriously, it's just what's going to drive my guess, isn't it? There's not much more I can go by, so why don't we say it? Why don't we say that uh, Sestachoa is the exact same thing as Swizetchietchoa? Are they the same? Uh, you can bet your ass they're not, but it's what I'm going to guess regardless. So yeah, why don't we why don't we go like that? Zadozi, sure. Let's go with Zadozi. Make the guess, and we were across in a uh, Lenzo, and oh, here it is, Suiyetsuchichoa. So yeah, you know, I would never have seen. I would never have zoomed in on this little corner. So far, I would have seen that, and even if I would have zoomed in, I wouldn't have seen it. But there you go. That close enough. Two thousand seven hundred fifty-five points. I like that. We are in. Alaska, the last frontier, which, I, I mean, is it, is it, what is Alaska, is it the frontier state or something like that, I don't really know, but uh, who knows, okay, let's go and see where we are, you know, we're, we're, we're pretty high up here, I would say, lots of uh, piney trees, not much I can go on, really, is there, no, okay, wow, I mean, this is just the, the big mountains really is what was driving me to think that, we're probably services one kilometer. Oh, okay. West River Park. Oh, okay. So we're not where I thought we were. We are definitely somewhere else. White River RV Park. White River. Now, would that be in BC or would that be in uh, somewhere else? I don't really know. White. Oh, my God. What the hell is going? Um, what the hell is going on? Well, that doesn't really matter. So let's go over here like this and try and check out what... What's going on? My God. Really should... Actually, you know what? My phone is definitely charged enough. I'm just going to... Sorry about that noise. You guys definitely... Eh, well, it's probably picked up on the microphone. I was going to say you might not have heard it because it's not in the recording, but, you know, I do have my speakers on because there's no sound in this game, so it's not like I actually do anything. We should probably find White River. White River is in northern BC. It would be in somewhere... Swan Lake. No. White River. Medizan Lake. No, Browser Lake, uh, how about you, are you White River? Maybe. Um, Kunsunk River, no, that's not it. Yeda River, Exile a Hill, oh my god, that's really cool. Uh, something, Katawa Soju National Park, uh, something Lake, Pillow Ridge, wow, that's a cool name. Tita Park, uh, any other, oh, are you, are you White River Park? I don't really think you are. Um, Gettys, Mount Will, St. Suesburg. St. Salisbury, are you White River? Chicken's Neck Mountain Reserve, how about you? No, you are the Mountains of the Triads, no, nothing over here. I, I, we could be we could be also in Baba Bowie National Park, okay. White Horse, no, I don't really think, I think we're probably around, I'm going to say like around here, uh, just as my guess, honestly, if I had to do something. Nass, Nos. Uh, let's go a little bit more north. Let's go somewhere like um, just right in here. Wilderness, Northern Rocky Mountain, Mount Doom, uh, Deneath. Let's go like here and then inside. Let's go like right around here. Make the guess. And we were, oh, so close to Alaska. We were right near Will and Grace National Park. Oh, God. And do we have any indication? 
No, no real indication. 2,226. What can I do? Pretty darn close. Okay, and for Russia. Yes, dot R U Hotilovram Narod. Hotilovram dot Narod dot R U. Now, maybe Narod is uh, the name of a place. Because it like it's dot narod right, so maybe like that's a, like a the city a municipality or something like that. Let's go over the road. Uh, do we see a narod anywhere? Any narods here? No, not that I can see. I don't really think I'm gonna find a narod. Um, Novgorod. Maybe we're on the road to Novgorod. I mean, it seems like we're always. I mean, the thing about it is that now uh, you see a lot of Russian roads. You didn't really see them that much before, but uh, you know now we're on the open road. Things have changed. The meta's changed. Oh, uh, we are in, um, that doesn't mean it. It probably means, like, rest stop or something. Don't really know what that uh, specifically could be. We're, we're on the wrong side of the road here. I should probably just turn around and look at the signs, because, I mean, the car's on the wrong side, so the signs are going to be harder and harder to read. Thanks for blurring that out. I really, oh, okay. We are in Kotil, oh, my God, look at that. A road sign that has the Romanized name. Oh. Oh, thank you. Thank you very much for that. My god. Kotilovo. Well, I don't think we're going to see it, but, like, that is, that's a first for me in Russia, seeing a sign that says that. Oh, my god, I can't believe it. Would you look at that? I, I mean, seriously, it's just, I'm blown away, honestly, right now, but... Novgorod, no, I don't see any Kotilovos anywhere. Maybe you guys have seen it. If you have, really, really lucky... God, I wish I could see something like that. Kotilovo, please. Uh, sh sure, let's go Let's go with the road to Ryzen. We never really guess it. Let's go, like, right around here. Honestly, I don't think I'm going to find it. It's not. It's no fun to just search a map forever. Oh, on the other side. Okay, so how far would I have to zoom in? Nope, wouldn't have found it. Wouldn't have found it. Wouldn't have found it. Wouldn't. Nope. Oh, are we ever... Oh, oh God, you have to go real close to start seeing this place. And it is small. So, there you go. Honestly, not as bad a guess as possible. 2,396. I never would have found that, really. So, there you go. That is very nice. Three minutes on the docket for probably... I was going to say Australia, but I don't actually think that anymore. I think we're somewhere else. I don't know. The lines on the road are weird. Yeah, we're somewhere they drive on the right side. We're somewhere... We're in a strange place. Oh, God. Oh, no. Is that all right? Well, maybe we can find a language or something. Are we in... I, I don't... Uh, what? Okay, are we in Brazil? Maybe. B L Z, Sur Serbin TV Serbin dot com. Um, God, are we? I don't. I don't know what. I don't know what is this. Uh, Brasileiro de Janeiro. I guess we must be in Brazil somewhere. Big phone numbers like that. Brazil. Ha. Okay. Well, sure. We're gonna say we're in Brazil then. Very, 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 very strange, whatever whatever this place is. My goodness, I have to say, it is sort of very unexpected, but... Oh, okay. I don't know, it's starting to look a little bit more like uh, the Brazil I was going to say know and love, but I don't really know it too much, although I really would like to go one day. Um, Estado Municipalo Juca Fortes. Well, maybe, uh, maybe we're going to see. Maybe that's a municipality, though. That's not a... Uh, that's not a, a really big, it's not like a big, um, Juca Fortes. Oh my god, it'll be too impossible to actually guess it inside here, is it? Yeah, it will be. So no, we can't find that. Uh, I really wish there was Hopital Mayo um, Municipal de Barros. Barros? Is that a place? I don't know. Barras, sorry, Barras. Is Barras a place? Acres, Rio Grande Norte, uh, no, alright, let's say I go sort of in here, am I going to start seeing a Barras, Paranara, no, none of these places are, are jumping out at me, it is a place that I could probably find on the map, honestly, but uh, specifically where it is doesn't really, it's not uh, not being tickled right here, Bahia, I can't, no, I'm not seeing it, not seen it anywhere. If you guys have seen it, you guys have got uh, those eagle eyes. Remember that movie, Eagle Eyes? That movie sucked, didn't it? Barras, sure. Let's go with uh, Barras de Gracas. Barra do Gracas. Although that's probably not right. Let's say we're there. And uh, let's go. We're in the municipality. So let's go like right outside or something. Like uh, right, right around here. 
and make the guess. Nope, completely wrong. Where, how far? Hold on, first, um, no, that doesn't say any, a darn thing. Nope, still not saying, oh, there's Baras, okay, so Baras, how, I would have had to be here. That is way too zoomed in for me to ever see. 2,010 points on the docket. So there you go, another round, 15,865. Which is which was mainly bolstered by the right on the dot Australia one, which is awesome. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed this episode. Please write down in the comments if you guys did good, if you guys did bad, if you guys have any tips, tricks, if you guys I don't know any cool things you guys write down. I always like seeing it. And anyway, and um, if you guys it's your first time, make sure you send in some challenges. And if it's our first time, so you can send in some challenges too. Tomorrow another viewer challenge. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed. And as always, I will see you guys next time. Oh yeah. Cue the royalty-free music. Three, two, one, go. Come on, everybody, get on your feet. Stand up, look at the screen, and repeat. I'm gonna like, rate, comment, and subscribe. I love watching Aether vids all of the time. Thanks for dropping by and spending the time. Hope you've enjoyed, and let's get on with our lives. Oh yeah. Thanks to Kevin McLeod for these awesome beats. Ooh yeah. Have a good one. Bye.